airlines to compensate passengers for delayed or cancelled flights soon. And Kila Ko Drambi Vandi sentenced to death for Bolan Lirahim's murder. I am Bola Oba and this is Plus Politics. Nigeria's aviation minister, Festus Keyamo, has said that domestic airlines will soon be compelled to compensate passengers for incessant delays and cancellations of flights. The minister disclosed this while speaking on flight destruction challenges during a meeting with the officials of airline operators of Nigeria, AON in Abuja. Kayamo said the regulators will begin to implement the provision of the Nigeria Civil Aviation Authority, NCAA Act, that mandates airlines to compensate passengers for delays, cancellations of flights, schedules caused by the airlines. Joining me to discuss this is Afolabi Sholebo. General Manager, Lagos State Consumer Protection Agency. Good evening, this evening, for Labi. Yeah, good evening, sir. It's a pleasure. Nice having it's, it's a pleasure to be on your program. And it's a pleasure to have you. Um, Thank you. Ordinarily, in the morning, before I was actually schooled by somebody who should be in the know, who actually reminded me about you, uh, our sister and friend, Shola uh, Salakwa Julo, who said you should be competent to do this. I was, I was looking all around Nigeria for Irukera, who I want to believe is actually out of Nigeria. But because I'm made to understand that you can do it, let's go for it. Would you, Thank you very much. Would you want to intimate a viewing public with what you do, what you actually do in your office in Lagos. Yes, thank you very much. Yes, um, uh, like you said, I'm the general manager of Lagos State Kopazuma Protection Agency. And the agency was established purportedly to ensure that consumers in Lagos State would get um, satisfaction and value for money and also to protect them against any form of hazardous products. Uh, on fair trade practices and even selling expired products. However, the Consumer Protection Agency is, a, is very wide. It covers all categories of breach of consumer rights and uh, the topic for discussion is no exception and uh, it is something that has been on my mind for a couple of times. I remember coming to Abuja to see the Vice Chairman of the Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Agency, and I specifically mentioned this issue, and um, we both agree that it is not right, and it is at the detriment of the consumers. Until I was lectured or enlightened this morning, like I told you, I felt it was an exclusive federal matter. But somebody then told me and said, Bola, you know what? Most of the transactions are done in states. And state consumer protection officers should be able, if a resident of a state has not gotten value for his or her money, should be able to go to the consumer protection agency. So you are telling me affirmatively at this juncture that it is within your portfolio to so protect the right of anybody that buys an air ticket in Lagos and who experiences cancellation and delays without being adequately uh, compensated? Definitely, yes. Because uh, most of the airlines do have their offices in Lagos. And uh, I could say, without missing words, the majority of the consumers are in Lagos. 
the inflow and outflow of aircraft from Lagos to other parts of the country is something that you cannot uh, uh, you know, just push away like that. And uh, we have, it is within the jurisdiction of the Lagos State Consumer Protection Agency, especially when we have a synergy with the Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Agency to protect all consumers because what we've been dealing with before now is the right of consumers to cancel advanced reservation of bookings. And I can tell you without missing words that a lot of those aircraft have been invited to this office. And fortunately, fortunately, most of the cases have been resolved in favor of the consumers. So the, the La Copa, as, as I say, the Lagos Consumer Protection Agency is in synergy with the Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Agency. So it is within our jurisdiction to ensure that consumers do get value for the money, especially since the majority of the aircraft do have their offices here in Lagos where bookings are made. And um, the pronouncement of the, um, the Minister of Aviation is a, is, is a welcome development because um, the issue of flight disruption is at the detriment of the consumers. And if consumers are to get value for their money... Listen, listening to you now, I, I feel like slapping myself. You know why? About more than a year ago, about a year and a month ago, a ticket, a return ticket to Abuja was bought for me. I got to the airport very early that morning. The airline had been susp was suspended by NCAA. And up until, as I'm talking to you now, the airline has refused to refund us. Indeed, about two or three months ago, the airline was trying to cajole me or force me to go to Enugu where I had no transaction and the, the, instead of just refunding money for a penalty that they suffered because they failed to meet the minimum safety measure of NCAA, now they have held my company's money for more than a year, they have not recompensed me, and they are even bouncing me, kind of cajoling me to go to a destination where I have no, <laughs> nothing to do at all. The, and I can tell you without mincing words that I have no right to, the, 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 the transaction was conducted in Lagos, and you're supposed to get satisfaction for your money. You are supposed to get value for your money. So if it is at their own day, if it's at their own making that your your flight was delayed or cancelled, definitely you should get a refund. The airline was actually and suspended. Nothing, the airline was like no. If they are suspended, they have uh, they have insurance, and I believe that they can pay you. It's 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 what they do. See, is that how we take the issue of consumers in this country? For me, I'm much more concerned about Lagos State. We should take them into consideration and ensure that consumers, in Lagos State, we use the slogan that consumers are kings. And as far as long as the Lagos State Consumer Protection remains, consumers will remain kings, no matter who stocks is called. I can tell you. And Mr. Governor of Lagos State, I've always said it, there's zero tolerance for breach of consumer rights in Lagos State. So in the backdrop, in the backdrop of the Honorable Minister's remark yesterday, um, what can somebody of your stature and position do to help many like me out there articulate their rights in law? Because according to the minister yesterday, there are actually some one or two statutes that protect the consumer's rights, and yet many of us are just Walking, you know, we, we deal with the airlines as zombies and they take advantage of our ignorance. Yes, thank you very much. I see. What we keep telling people is that they have rights. Whether goods are sold to you or services are rendered to you, and whenever you think there's a breach of that right, you should seek redress. 
And in Lagos State, the only place you can seek redress is the Lagos State Consumer Protection Agency. From statistics, I will tell you, in the year 2022 alone, about Hello, are you there? And yes, I can hear you. Okay, then. About 47,144 flights were delayed or cancelled. And this is not a result or maybe the making of the consumer. This is well stipulated in the act by the NCAA that cancellation or delay in flight, the consumers are supposed to be compensated. If airline does not have the capacity to meet current financial obligations, must it because don't think they want to bear the problems? If so, but one thing we keep educating consumers, they have rights. Most people will like, oh, I leave it to God. But if you have worked very hard for your money, I mean, worked very hard for your money, and you 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 were supposed to be offering a service that you paid for, definitely. You should get value for your money and satisfaction. It is simple. Flight delays and in some cases, outright cancellation means the consumers will suffer. So where will the consumer go? If it's I, I, I really, I, I really, um, I, I'm very happy that we having you this evening. You know why? If it could happen yes. to me, and I, I am. Um, acting as though I am helpless and I know somebody like you and I forgot that it's a strictly consumer uh, protection issue and I didn't take it to somebody like you. I didn't even broach it with my sister who I had earlier con contacted this morning. Uh, then I I'm thinking, do we have a culture of uh, I, I pass it to God's, to God's court? Is that quite uh, <laughs> I think that is one of the mistakes or the mistakes most consumers are making. I can quickly refer you to the um, to the social media handles of the Lagos State Consumer Protection Agency and look at things that we've done. And I will tell you that if you go through and browse through, you will see that so many airlines issues have been resolved. So many more I'm not talking about local local airlines alone, even international. Money has been refunded back to consumers. Because one thing I know is that Hello there. Consumer rights. But it is only when consumers know their rights and where to seek redress. That is why they will get justice. And I can tell you without missing words that Lagos State Consumer Protection Agency will do everything within the ambit of the law to protect Lagosians so, and anybody that transact business in Lagos State. Let, let me be a bit more forensic in the questions I ask now. You are, okay. partic you are practically telling me that once the commercial or contractual transaction took place on Terra Firma Lagos, Lagos State Consumer Protection Agency is there to protect the customer. Yes, the Lagos State Consumer Protection is there to protect the consumers. And um, this is possible because we, we, we operate both the, the Lagos State laws and the Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Act of 2009. 18. And also, we have this synergy. The Federal Commission and Consumer Protection Agency being a stakeholder when it comes to the issue of protecting consumers, we have a synergy. So most times, we do synergize together on issues. But this is the jurisdiction. If it's a jurisdiction, all we need to do is just communicate with the, with the Federal Competition and we can get the go-ahead. And most times we do get the guy because we all um, facing the same things, and the aim of both agency and the commission is to protect consumers in Nigeria and Lagos State respectively. For and that's what we've been doing. For anybody watching this program as it is now, 
And he or she is feeling, oh, I bought that item. I remember the last time I brought you on my show, it was in respect of an article I read about you, how you protected the consumer who was, being, who was about being robbed of his privileges and rights by a, a major a electronic shop where he bought uh, a, a phone item and the item did not serve, did not live up to the purpose and you, you went into it and got, you almost got the place shut down and they recompensed the, the gentleman. He wrote a fantastic piece about that. For anybody watching now, wanting to raise an issue related to consumer protection, which uh, social media platform or, or um, Andrew should they be looking at? Or how, would they, how could they get in touch with you or your office? Thank you very much. Yes, thank you very much. I, yes, I am I'm, I'm, I'm very, very, I can remember vividly that I was invited by you when that happened. And so many people, it was a, it was a shock that there's an agency that can actually protect the rights of consumers, not only in Lagos, but uh, in, in, in Lagos and its environs. See, people can, we are, on, we are on all social media handles. We are on Instagram, we are on Twitter, which is now X, and also on Facebook. And uh, after that um, incident went viral, we will be receiving so many complaints. And I can assure you, when we have over 8,347 uh, complaints and results over 8,424 of it, that shows more than 90%. Uh, and people can even get us on Facebook, LASD Cooper. On X, LASD Cooper. Then on Instagram, Lascopa at Instagram. It's easy. All you need to do is lodge your complaint. If you cannot come to our office at Saudi Arabia, close off Allen Avenue, we also have our other office at Ikoyo Balende, Bariga, Badagri, Ikorodu, and Ojo local governments. So, if the, 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 the consumers are king. And even the service providers, the manufacturers, the marketers, they know all this. I, maybe I, I didn't tell you about a case of, uh, I won't mention the name now, a, 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 an auto, 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 auto company that sold vehicles. They sold vehicles and uh, we got complaints that the vehicle were under three, four months. Com vehicles are supposed to last for three, three years or there about warranty. And they told me it was a joke. And they lost it. There's nothing like no refund policy. That's another thing people don't know. There is nothing. Like no refund policy. No, uh, you, you it is there. No, we recovered uh, uh, no. 30 million for those vehicles because they uh, lost refund for the vehicles. I know there, there was a the, 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 the complaints are still alive. There was, a, there was a glitch when you were talking. I, I would want you to carefully repeat this. You are saying that there is nothing like no refund policy in Lagos State that should work or will work against consumers. Yes, and I reconfirm there is nothing like no refund policy. Let consumers not be taken by what they write on their receipts and everything. The position of the law is very clear, both federal and state. There's nothing like no refund policy. If you if 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 you have been if if a product is sold to you and that product does not meet your satisfaction, or the product in most cases defective in nature, definitely you have the right for replacement or refund. If you cannot, if the, if the product cannot be replaced for you, you have a right to get refund. And, and I can assure you, the record is there. When you go on uh, social media handles, you will see. Uh, do, 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 they, they, do they didn't go to the extent of telling their, uh, their testimonies. Okay. A whole lot of testimonies are there, and this is not something that you can conjure. 
Okay, all the, all the, all the, let's all the use this. All the beneficiaries are dead. Let, let's use this opportunity now uh, for you to gently, but in wrapping up, close by telling our viewers how they can engage your agency should they be in a sorry situation like I found myself and I forgot that uh, I, I have that agency to hand. Yes, thank you very much. If a consumer right out there, I will ask, have you purchased a product recently? Or have you been rendered any service that you are not satisfied with? Please, do not suffer in silence. As a consumer, you have right to safety. You have right to be informed. You also have right to choose and be heard. You have right of satisfaction of basic needs. Please. Come to Lagos State Consumer Protection Agency and speak to dress. Because they have right to consumer education and healthy environment. And wherever any of those rights have been breached in all categories of consumer breach, please make a complaint and speak to dress at the Lagos State Consumer Protection Agency. Okay. Our office is located at number 2B, Soji Adipi Backloads, off Allen Avenue. You can also reach us in any of our Lasting offices. Ikoyo Balinde, Bariga, Badagri, Ikorodu, Ojo local government, and also at uh, Badagri local government. You can also reach us on all these numbers 081 and 08095. Five zero seven five zero nine seven seven seven. time is not quite very kind on a program like this. I really want to appreciate you for this value addition to our viewing public. Thank you for coming. That is how we wrap up that segment. We go on a short break and we'll be back.